everybody! I'm the Lightning Turk, and I fucked up for the last video for, um, for Victorian. So, <laughs> I'm depressed. I, so, um, you know how you have to stick the microphone in the micro, microphone thing? Like, the thing specifically for it? Thing designed for it? Yeah, that, uh, I forgot to do that. I, I stuck it instead in the headphones portion, so my voice came out like shit. <laughs> I mean, it came out like buggy and blurry. So, uh, like, foggy, or... I, I, I don't know, I don't know really, like, how it would come up, burp, anyways, um, yeah, that made me sad today, moving on, we are, um, I don't know what day this is, we are in year 1922 of the, um, of the Alliance game, of the Inner Alliance RPU game, and things are going rather swimmingly as nations are expanding and things are actually happening. And people are actually being active and posting. You know, that, that makes me happy. When, when you guys post, it, it just makes me elated to see to see excitement in, in games. So, um, the South Canadians, uh, led by Sir Charles Tupper, more correctly Controbot, are doing rather well by taking Hotreve and... <sighs> This guy. How the fuck do you? How the fuck do I pronounce this? For for God's for Goomba's sake for for Buddha's sake for for deity's sake. How the fuck do I pronounce this? Ku kuju kujurapik kujurapik kuju. Yeah, just that right there. So uh, he's taken those two provinces, and he finally has a direct assault line to Labrador City. So if he can take the capital. Pretty much the rest of the nation will fall apart. However, uh, from what I've heard from him, he has no troops to do it. So he's having a lot of trouble with this uh, unification of Canada. The Americans haven't done much. They they still have um, troops on the borders of the Native American tribes over here. These three provinces. Um, I'm guessing they're going to invade in the upcoming year. Or more correctly, on day change. Nothing happened in uh, Russia or Finland. However, something good has happened in Europe. The tension between Germany and Italy has finally ended, as Italian forces have finally diverted their air forces um, elsewhere instead of in the Bavarian Tyrol region. So that makes me happy, sort of, not really. Um, aside from that, East Algeria hasn't done much. Nothing's really happening with Morocco and um, West Algeria. Spain hasn't really done much. Spain has fallen into a communist nation. Egypt is now communist. The other Libya is now communist. Pretty much everything in the region is communist. Just communism everywhere. So we're just trying to do that. We're just trying to stop that. The uh, Turkic Arabian Federation has taken down uh, Bulgaria. So all that's left is the capital of Sofia. We've taken Varna. We've taken Pleven. We've taken Plovdiv. So that that's yeah. We're building. We're building military barracks in an effort to gain more troops and make our uh, supply chains better as well as make a larger army in in general so uh that's pretty much a quick recap a very fucking quick recap since we don't really have much to talk about in this game since nobody fucking joins it in the alliance uh but <laughs> my bitching aside People joined it, and then they went in inactive, so, you know, I don't really have a problem with them. But I haven't really kicked the inactive, so if you want to, you know, if, you, if you're interested in joining, just, you know, just get back in the game. <laughs> get back in the game and just fu fucking be active, you know, just join the game. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. <laughs> uh, GG, guys. I, I think this is like a minute and a half, maybe like three minutes. I highly doubt it's anything long. So I'll see you all later. Um, peace!